More than 125,000 marchers are on the Boston Common to be a part of one of the largest women's marches in the nation. Prominent Massachusetts politicians join them with messages of solidarity, hope, and resistance. Now we can whimper, we can whine, or we can fight back. Me, I'm here to fight back. We want Washington to hear what's going on on Boston Common today. This is where the abolitionist movement started, right here. This is where the suffragette movement started. This is who Massachusetts is. Now is the time, folks, to be brave, to be fearless, and to do what we need to do. Together we can, together we will, and I am so looking forward to marching together today and every day forward. Let as Americans and you know this is obviously a women's march and we're here because of uh, Donald Trump you know obviously uh, and he's pretty much disrespected women throughout the whole campaign and he's been you know now as president here to tell him that that's not okay. We stick together when we're needed and this is a prime example of when we're needed we can come together and I think it's great it, it makes you want to be a boss. For BU News Service I'm Zoe Mitchell.